lingies, you have your gel, your ch ch, and you you dig it, you gotta. You know the breath test, you know that breath test thing, right? And then you do the, the other sniff test. If you pass out, you're not ready. I'm telling you right now. Don't go. So now you're ready, right? You're waiting. You get in the car and you go. <coughs> and they're really the car is laughing at you. He's <laughs> like. And then you can't get there. Is it counted or not counted? It's counted. That was a trick question, man. It's counted because hamma you did something, you acted, but there's something called ha'il or aiq. It's called aiq, meaning it was a hurdle, but you won it and you win it. But when am I? What am I talking about? If you stopped on your own, you did the thingy, that seat, but on the way to the car, you said astaghfirullah. How could I? How could I use the beauty that Allah gave me to use an instant? How could you use the, the, the health that Allah gave me to use it against him? How could you use the car that Allah gave me to use it against him? And, 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 and. and he says, Astaghfirullah. I stop. Or I repent from a sin I did. What happens? It turns into a good deed. Look at that. It's amazing. Look at the beauty and the blessing of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Never despair of Allah's mercy. We said that. So do the math. You intend to do a good deed, one good deed is written. Without you doing it, you do it, it's multiplied by 10 or 700. You intend to do a bad deed, nothing. You on the way to the bad deed, you stop, it's a hasana. You do the bad deed, it's the one bad deed, and you repent, it's a hasana. Allahu Akbar. So I'm asking you, how? How do you go to the hellfire, man? How do you go to the hellfire with every one deed and 700? One bad deed is only one. You must have been really a loser in order for you to go to hellfire with this type of math, man. Really? So now, what is the punishment? The scholar says in the Ashab al Araf, those who stay in the half and halfway, they can see the hellfire. Okay? And they go, oh, we don't want to go there. Turn them, <laughs> please. You know, you know, waiting, you're waiting for your decision. Imagine you're waiting for your report card in the final exams. And the brothers, you're waiting for your wife to get the, the, the delivery for the baby. Remember? This is waiting is their punishment, according to the scholars. Hold on. Did that answer your question, Ufti? Allah. Any other questions, sorry? Sorry about that. Uh, okay. Uh, sorry, sorry, Ahmed. <laughs> it's going. It's my thing, man. Okay. Yes, my brother. I understand, but this is what the scholar says. It's not rewarded for that. Inshallah. Okay, uh, for the, uh, uh, the the people that are have uh, what's the word for it? Uh, what's the uh, what's the word? The politically correct, disabilities. not disabilities. Handicap, not handicap. No, no, no. There's something else now. Special. Challenged. It's not insane. Okay. There's something. You know what I'm talking about. There's a word for it nowadays. Special needs. Or something, whatever. Okay, anything. <laughs> I got. Okay, I got the gym. I got the gist. Okay, I got the drift, guys. I got. You. Oh, thank you, brother. All right. Now, <laughs> so, Allah. What happens? Look at the mercy of Allah. You will enter heaven straight. No accountability. No punishment. No reckoning. Straight to heaven. Beautiful, isn't it? Allah Akbar. That is the beauty of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy. Okay? So this is uh, answering that question of Allah. Yes. Like any special like blind or staff. Okay, I'm talking about the person that cannot differentiate between lawful and unlawful. Incompetent. Hey, thank you, Sir Rabbi Akhil, comes back, comes through again. Thank you, Ufti. I want you to stay here every night, Ufti, because every time I get stuck, she helps me out. All right. Now, the one that is, uh, for example, blind, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the hadith says, إِذَا أَخَدْتَ حَبِيبَتَيْهِ If I take away حَبِيبَتَيْهِ the, the beloved, إِذُبُلَاتَ وَبِلَعُ إِلَّا الْجَنَّةِ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, if I take that from my servant, my slave, I will reward him with Jannah. I believe I actually listened to Sister Rabia Khidr about the Isna conference. 
something that really got to me. Really, wallahi. It really got to me. He says, I, and I thank Allah that I don't see what's around me, so I'm not, I, I'm paraphrasing, I'm not quoting, I'm, uh, that I'm not tested or even to see the things that I don't want to or even uh, I'm happy the way I am. Subhanallah. As, uh, wallahu alam. Is that close enough, Mukti? Okay. She will come and let her rectify me, inshallah. But it really got to me. Wallahi, I, I cried. I actually cried. I said, Subhanallah, you don't really know the blessing of the eyes. And I gave a test to the brothers of Fajr one time for the school of Ramadan. And I told him, listen, I want you to close your eyes for a few seconds. And could you imagine your whole life like that? Not seeing anything, the beauty of the creation, the colors, not knowing if it's this or that, night or day, go or not, who, where, touch, feel, so, and, and nothing. And then open your eyes again. Go, wow, it's amazing. You should be thankful. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, if I take the two beloved from my, my slave, I will reward him with Jannah. So yes, Akhid, it is rewarded with Jannah, inshallah. And there is more, of course. Wallahu alayhi. So we're good with the question? One question from sister, one question from Okay, now let me ask you because we're over time. I want to make sure that it's one hour specifically because I don't want to uh, take more than that. From the time of prayer to the time we finish, it's one hour, inshallah. Okay, sisters. First question coming your way. Uh, None of you accept? I can't, I can't really translate it because it will give it away. Does it mean in that verse, does it mean that you... Uh, what does that verse mean? <laughs> you know what I mean by that verse? No, that's a terrible question. I can't... I, I'll take that question back. You don't mean you don't mean you don't mean Okay, now it's back. If you play that backwards, really hear now some neat hidden messages. Freddy is a devil. Freddy is a devil. Okay. Now, the question for you again, sisters. <laughs> How many times uh, the hellfire I should have been asking this guy, how do you turn an answer into a question? What's that uh, show? <laughs> Jeopardy, right? No, or something not Jeopardy. Is it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. he turns it into a question. I should have learned from him. How do you get a question? <laughs> what is the number am I looking for? Comparative in the hellfire on uh, the, and the fire on earth. Did you understand the question at all? <laughs> Seventy! Allah Akbar! So they did get the question. Alhamdulillah, I was doubting myself actually. Seventy times. Brothers, what does seventy mean in Arabic? Nah, no, give me somebody else. Somebody else. No, somebody else. You said something, you said something, you said something. Did you say something? Go ahead. Infinity, good for you. Sisters, what did Umar al-Khattab used to do? The sister next to Ali now. Go ahead. Huh? Right on. Okay, go ahead. Give her one. Okay. And he's got it. He used to place his hand on top of that candle, uh, flame of a candle, and used to say, Brothers, what do you see us say from the brothers? Go ahead, Ali. Hello? He used to say, I'm sure he used to say something. It's coming. It's coming. I feel the vibes. I feel, oh, uh, yeah. Yes? Yes. Allahu Akbar. Allah Akbar. Allah Akbar. Allah Do you have patience on, uh, on such a... I can't speak, but you know what I mean, right? I was going to say, a claim of a fendel. I'm dyslexic, so you can tell. Not a claim of a fendel, it's a fendel of a claim. <laughs> I mean, a, a flame of a candle. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, sisters. Let's see now. We're tied? We're tied. Good, 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 good. Tie break. Tie break. No more questions. Because I can't think of any. I don't have it tonight. Uh, tie break question. Right. Ah. There's a trick question. Be careful. Be careful. 